In this brief video, I'm going to show you how to record and publish a Zoom session from eClass. First, join or start your meeting. And select more, or if it's available to you on the tray, record. Recording to the cloud is the preferred option for instructors to be able to record and have that recording published back on eClass in a cloud tab in a Zoom tool available to both you and your students. For students, you may only see record on this computer. If your instructor is already recording this lecture or your presentation, you need to take no further steps. To record to the cloud, click on record to the cloud. A message will be sent to all members saying recording in progress. As well, you will see a small cloud with a red blinking dot signifying that the meeting is being recorded. As an instructor, you can pause the meeting. There will be another message saying the recording is, has been stopped. And resume. A message will be stated that the recording has returned and is recording again and is in progress. The difference between stopping and pausing is that if you wish to pause the meeting, you can continue recording in the same string, meaning that you can pause it multiple times and receive one recording. If you select stop, this message will appear and it will stop the recording and finalize this chunk when the meeting is ended. A message will say that recording is stopped and you will receive an email at the end of this saying that your meeting is ready to be published for your students. Clicking more again, you can record to the computer. Another message will be sent to all members. You can hear that the same messages are sent for the same options here. The only difference is this does not have a cloud. Instead, it has a traditional recording button, and this file will be downloaded on your computer at the end of the session. So we're going to stop this recording and end the session. This will finalize both sets of recordings or any recordings that you have done. The audio and video, which also includes the audio, are downloaded automatically to your computer and available for you. These can be uploaded to either Google Drive or YouTube, or if they're smaller than 100 megabytes, can be uploaded back into eClass. For more information on publishing other than using the Zoom tool in the cloud, please view those videos. I have also received an email now that states that my cloud recording has been completed and is available for students. Returning to my class, we can see that the cloud recordings tab now holds recordings that I have created. To view them, simply click on the name and you may view or download the recording for the full audio and video or listen to the audio download it, share it externally, but students will have access to this once it has been published by an instructor clicking Publish. Students and instructors can now have access to this as long as they click on the link in the course and click on Cloud Recordings. Thank you for watching.